Good morning. We're here once again to show you the third part of our video series in our spring services, which includes scalping, core aeration, and then last but not least, top dressing. Now, top dressing is a unique service in itself. Now, what top dressing is, is actually taking what we call river sand mixture that we use. You'll see a lot of people who use white play sand, and white play sand is not the best sand to top dress with. It will give you the level application that you're trying to find, but at the same time, the acid in the white play sand is, is not very good for your root zone and your, and, your, and your grass. So we actually use a river sand. And not only that, it also blends in much better. So aesthetically, people don't drive by and see these big white areas that are in your yard from where you've sanded. Now, the application of river sand and sanding simply does several things. Number one, it does help eliminate thatch, which is very vital. It also promotes root zone growth. And also, it's applied to, to one quarter to an eighth minimum inch in application. Now, if you have a low area, of course, we actually will build those areas up to where they're level, allowing the grass to actually fill in and grow over the river sand area. Now, in applying river sand, it's a process that we use that's very laborious. We actually uh, kind of do it the old fashioned way here at Bennett Landscape. We take it, we spread it out with uh, shovels, and then we come back and we actually broom it in. Once again, you don't want to apply too much sand because if you do, you actually can smother the root zone system. Now I'm going to have Ty over my employee at Bennett Landscape actually demonstrate to you how we top dress and in the, in the proper procedure of top dressing. As you can see, he's actually got a shovel full of the river sand. And what he's going to do is actually throw the sand out and then come back and broom it in to level it out and make sure that it that covers the whole surface area. At this time, Ty is going to demonstrate that for you. As you can see, he's shaking out the sand and getting coverage. And then once he's done that, let's get one more uh, tie. As you can see, he's not just dumping it in one pile. He's actually shaking it out to get good coverage there. And then once he's done that, now he'll take a broom and actually broom it in. We want that sand to get down to the root zone and, and on top of the zone. As he sweeps it in, and what this does, it levels it out causes it to fill in the low areas, causing the turf to be more level. And you'll notice that if you mow your own grass, you'll notice that it really helps as far as your lawnmower and how smooth the, the, the lawn is to mow once you top dress. Now keep in mind, some lawns may be uh, in worse shape than others, therefore one application of top dressing may not solve the problem. It may take more than once. Top dressing is recommended to do once a year but yet not necessary as much as, as scalping and core aeration is. But we would encourage you to do top dressing on your lawn and to see the benefits and how much, how much better your lawn looks and more beautiful throughout the year by top dressing in the river sand. Thanks again for watching Bennett Landscape video on how to, to scalp, how to core aerate, and how to top dress your lawn for the spring season. Thanks very much. We appreciate your business.